Hello everybody, Hyper Mario Sunshine here, and what the hell is going on? Ling. Ling. Be on your guard. Ganon's power grows. It rises to its peak under the hour of the blood moon. By its glow, the aimless spirits of monsters slain in the name of the light return to flesh. Link, please be careful. Well, that's very interesting and scary. And look, the enemy that I defeated off screen just respawned. So yeah, that's the Blood Moon, and uh, whenever this stuff comes out, like this little ember-like smoke, and it be the sky becomes all red, yeah, that's the Blood Moon uh, starting, and all the enemies you've defeated have respawned. So yeah, there's that. <laughs> Good luck. Anyways, let's keep going. Uh, actually, we do have this now. We could use our croc leaf. And we just wasted something. Oh. Forgot we have to hit the sail. Oh, I guess we're blocked. Uh, I think we have to turn this around then. Oh god, they're attacking us. I, this was a bad idea. Yeah, let's let's just not bother. I was gonna be like, you know, let's do this a cool fast way where we just sail and be all fun, but nope. No sailing for us. Just beat the living hell out of everyone instead. Is this a wooden box? No, it's not. That's a metal box. Okay. I meant to say the other way around. Got some arrows two out of it. Let's see what's in here. Got some shock arrows. So these involve electricity. Uh, obviously. All right. Goodbye. Oh, fuck. Spiked Boko beer. Uh, got a crab. Well, baked crab. A blackened crab. Plus a baked. This our claymore is almost broken. And it is broken. And the weapon durability is a lot less than I remember it being. We need it higher. And we got some blue rupees, okay. She's getting pretty close to it by now. Got some more of them. Just beat the shit out of them. Just... Keep beating the shit out of them. Oh! Yeah, we got our, I guess our, that's our carry reviving us there. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna beat the shit out of you. But I want to do this a fun way where I just use my cool magnesis and just, you know, go crazy on some mob ones, but I guess not. Arrows, blue rupee. Rupees are always good. Also, a by the time this recording, I believe the new update came out for uh, Pokemon, the new Pokemon Snap. So uh, I still haven't done a review for that game. Uh, I plan on doing one soon, hopefully. And also, the review for Pikmin Three I still haven't done, even though I've beaten it. Wow, there's a lot of stuff that I keep forgetting to do. 
days. We're getting pretty close. I keep saying we're pretty close, but I'm not even sure if we are in the right place. Were we just not here at the West Gate? Yeah, we were. Oh my god. Uh, are we not even on the right mission? Pretty sure I was supposed to be going to... Oh my god, it's bringing me to my captured memories. Okay. Read the Divine Beast in the top right, which we're, we're not even heading to. I guess we'll head this way again. Oh my god, that was so dumb. Or I guess up here would actually be better. Yeah, we had our, even though I set my thing to the right path, it just auto bought me back here. Because I went on the, uh... Because I actually saw a memory. Without even, you know, having the guide to bring me to one. It's telling me to go to my the closest one to me. Which is pretty weird. Let's go up on this cliff. And as we can see, we're seeing some formations. We're seeing uh, two of the locations, actually. Can't really see the others. It's down there. Is there any shrines nearby? There's something over there, though. And we also actually need to get that, so we can open up the location. We're actually very close to it. See what is down there, or who is down there. Yeah. Oh, so you hear, heard humming. I'm Eric. I'm a tra tra traveling the world of journey of self discovery. Heading to Zora's main now, but I'm lost. Just about to give up. But then, like, I heard a voice coming from the North Tower. Crossing Ratula River to impot. It be next to impossible, though. Oh. So Rosa Main is a home of Zora. It's a town in Lanaru. Crossing the Rotilla River is impossible. It's a hard place to get to, so I just gave up altogether. Mm -hmm. oh. Someone's up there. Ah. Tower, huh? Let's see what's around us here. It's a very beautiful place here. There's not really much to really worry about. There's actually a deer. Oh, I guess even the maximum maximum self can't fool these deer. Or does. In that, in that case. And that freaking goat just tried to freaking ram right into me. What the? Oh, shit! Oh, pardon me, I didn't think anyone was around. But that there, on your hip. No, I'm sorry, it's nothing. I don't mean to pry. Have you ever, never met a Rita before? Odd. My name is Cass. As a bard, I spend my days traveling this land in search of ancient songs. Have you heard of the ancient songs of Hyrule? Ancient songs, songs that sing the praise of a hero that who beat... The Calamity in an Age Past. I know a song about this place. Would you like to hear an ancient verse passed down to this re in this region? Let's hear it. Excellent, without further ado. A beast that wears a crown of bone, prancing through the lush green. Mount the beast upon its throne, for only the shrine is seen. I suppose the lush green could refer to this place, but what sort of beast wears a crown of bone? There certainly is a secret hiding here, but it's beyond me. May the light illuminate your path. So this is the crown beast, and it's a shrine uh, quest, weirdly. And I guess this must happen at night, so we need something that wears a bone-like crown, or at least is having something bone around its head. So yeah, that's Cass there. We'll actually see him quite a bit. I actually did see him in the uh, Lost episode 12, where uh, I accidentally got killed multiple times and uh, tried doing the island challenge. And we got ourselves another Karakarok. 
Wait, Korok. Oh my god, I don't know why I keep mispronouncing these guys. And there's certainly a lot of bones over there. First, we need to unlock this land, so obviously we're going to head there at first. You can see uh, Hyrule Castle right there, too. It does not look pretty, with uh, all those clouds and such around and the, the malice surrounding it. Anyways, let's head here to the tower. And then, uh, obviously, we're going to head, be heading to uh, Zora's Domain, which is where we'll be heading for our first... And wow, I see two shrines here. Could easily go after them, but they're pretty far compared to the tower. Yeah, these are some giant bones. I mean, something pretty big must have uh, died here. Or at least multiple big things must have died here. Alright, uh, I think there's also a very giant uh, tree uh, tower. Yes, there is. So there's probably going to be a lot of enemies there. No worries, we're going to be taking them down. And there's also a shrine nearby as well, wow. And my chair loaded itself again. I'm, you know what, this is going to become a theme. W until I get a new chair. Oh my god. Yeah, just bash it on the head. Uh, let's see, what do we got? This is sword, sword. This sword. Sword. Oh, you've got a... Why don't they take any knockback? Did I auto save at least close by? Uh, once again, lifting up my chair. I need a new one. This thing's breaking down by the like the second. Oh my god! It's auto saved before I grab the Karaka. Oh, never mind. Did it after then? Yeah, we really need to see more of the map around here, because, unfortunately, without it, I don't think we're going to be able to find our way there. Well, I mean, we can, but it'll just take some good guesses. Let's try this again. Let's go up that giant treehouse of sorts. Getting into uncharted territory. Well, I guess for us, it's pretty much charted for most other people in this era of Hyrule. And the X, I forgot to mention that the X marks the spot, actually indicates where we died. Shrines. Got a hearty radish. You serious? <laughs> Fuck you. What is this? It's a soldier spear. up here. It's probably the, uh, a watch guard of sorts. So there's a treasure chest over there, so that's going to be intriguing to get. Wow, they did not, oh, okay, never mind, it's falling down. Let's see what's down here. Five arrows, neat. Oh, 
Oh god. Yeah, that just became really scary. So, see what's in here. Silver bow, nice. But our inventory is full, even though this is a brand new, uh, more powerful bow. Bow favored by the Zora. So yeah, another Zora themed item. Okay, just fall off. No! What the? These guys don't take any knockback. What the hell? Please tell me you auto saved. God. Oh my god. Uh shit 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 shit. Wait for it to come back up here, I guess. See anything else? Why the fuck is there another watch guard over there? The shrine's quite close as well. Oh, those are whiz robes! Uh, very, very. Dangerous creatures. Especially because their rods are actually really powerful. And they actually could cast storms with these rods. As well, which is, uh... Very dead... Okay. Oh god, what the fuck? Yeah, it could actually make it start snowing, believe it or not. Yeah, so it will try killing us via cold, which is uh, very dangerous. We'll eat this for now. Yeah, it makes giant balls of hail fall from the sky, too. See, so yeah, it's going to keep snowing until we kill this thing. Oh my god, break out, Link! There we go! We got an ice rod. So, yeah, there's the rod weapons. They bought that back. Let's throw the way the what a mob, obviously. Finally, the weather returned to normal. We got some rain before the sun cleared out. I guess because the temperature warmed up and also because clouds were here. Makes sense. That would, uh, the, the, the snow would turn into rain. <laughs> I need to get rid of that. I don't want to waste all of it. Uh, where is that temple, though? Oh, it's right there. Guess we'll head over there after we uh, climb up the tower. Actually, very close to getting to. A narrow tower is here, so we're finally going to be making it to Zora's Domain in a bit. a little bit more.
Whew, how much longer? Holy shit, that's probably like the tallest tower yet. Well, I guess because we already did a bunch of climbing to get here. No! No! That was the sound of me smacking myself across the face. You know, I thought I made it up, but I guess my angle was just very awkward. Hopefully we killed that Wizrobe, and that Wizrobe didn't res respawn. Okay, it was after we killed it. Okay, that's better. Why? I don't get that. Like, I literally don't. I'm trying to go to that, like, little platform, but it's like, nope. God, I need a new chair. It's becoming increasingly more uncomfortable to sit on each time. Like, I'm probably going to keep complaining about it until the... Until I eventually do get one. Right, we're almost there. God, can we actually make this? Oh my god, just barely. There we go. Sheikah Tower activated. So, finally, we've done it. We've unlocked it. The Nehru Tower. And it brings us access to the entire location on our map. And it could, well, and it's going to make us make it this uh, trip to... Uh, Zoro's Domain, much easier. Should probably do in the next episode. After this uh, next shrine that's like right beneath the tower. And... There it is! Yeah, a lot of the East Coast is now basically unlocked. Zora's up there. Wow, I can't believe it. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes, you. I am Groove of the Zora. It is apparent you are a traveler. But I may ask what... I, I ask what brought you here. Hmm. I can suit you. Uh, an excellent curie, indeed. I order... By order of Prince Sidon of Zora's Domain, I am searching for Hylian, where I was, but then I fell asleep. I woke to a loud noise, then quaking, and now here I am. I'd like to be on my way down, and da I'd like to get down and be on my way, but it's simply too hi high up. I needed to figure out something out. Prince si Sidon is down at the bridge below, but for some reason I cannot seem to catch his attention. But you, you are highly in, yes? Well, my, my luck is improving. Prince Sidon, I found one! I found a Hylian! Mm. Mm, Prince Sidon doesn't seem to notice my struggle. Perhaps I should swallow my fear and just and jump to the river below. Then I should return to him. Nope, nope, I can't do it. I'm too high up. I'm likely meet the gods to, of ever of the ever after before I ever see Prince Sidon again. Mr. Hailey, I must apologize. It'll be some time before I can get back to Prince Sidon. Please, you must leave me here and go ahead, on ahead. I think he's down there. Before we can meet him, let's go to this tower. Well, not tower, the shrine. Oh, and there's another Zor here, actually. They are wearing armor as well, and also look how beautiful it's getting here. Oh my, how wonderful! You're Hylian, yes? Perfect! It must be my lucky day. Oh, ahem. <clears throat> I apologize for calling out to use for so suddenly. I'm Tor Torferu Torfil of the Zora. 
and I have been searching for a Hylian like you for a long, very long time. My home is Zora's domain and a terrible danger. That That is why Prince Sidon sent me in search for a strong Hylian warrior. Ah. Prince Sidon is waiting at the Inigo Bridge. Would you please talk to the prince and perhaps save us all? We would be ever so grateful. It seems to be raining here quite a bit, too, so I guess the rain must be occurring often here at the Zora's Domain, especially because they're fish-like creatures. It's very hard to get cold here, too. Alright, so we're going to end off with by doing this shrine. Appears to be happening. A minor test of strength. Okay, it's just a minor test. Nothing too crazy, hopefully. Yeah, the one of the the one that I went into was a major test of strength, and that one was ridiculous. Right, there we go. It's got a shield and it's got a sword. So the guardian uh, sword is actually really good for this. Oh shit. Yeah, it also does this attack where it spins around to make it bump into this shit with the giant towers. Yeah, it's gonna constantly keep doing this. And it also has a laser mode. Yeah, I guess that also stops it quite a bit in its tracks. Oh, dang, I tried parrying it. There we go. Oh god, it's firing a beam. Yeah, this is basically like its last resort. Oh, thank God. Okay, we got a guardian shield. Holy shit. That was close. Yeah, that's like its last resort, I guess. Uh, guess we don't really need a torch for now. Especially because we're in very wet lands. Got a Guardian Sword, nice. We've got an Ancient Shaft, and a few Ancient Springs, nice. And we've got ourselves a Treasure Chest waiting for us at the end, and obviously our, our Orb. Let's see what's in here. Got a Knight's Bow, and this one is probably the most powerful weapon we've received yet. Oh, stop going back, oh my god. Uh, drop this. There we go. Anyways, I think that's it for today's episode. We're nearing Zora's Domain, finally. So love my videos, hit the like button, make sure to subscribe to my channel, I appreciate it. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we'll be heading to Zora's Domain and also meeting with the Prince Sidon. See you guys 